Hello everyone. Uh, welcome. Um, I changed into a bee. Uh, <laughs> before starting recording because... Okay, don't mind that. Um, because... Yeah, I think we need to be him to get this jiggy, right? Oos! Oh, there's one more. There's another jiggy somewhere in this in Grunty's lair. Um, where were, I don't know. Where was the Rusty Bucket Bay jiggy? Did I get that? No, I did. No, I did. I, um, did I get that? I, I hit. I, I know I hit the switch. Huh. I don't know. I'll figure it out later, maybe. It's only, it's only one jiggy. <laughs> That's weird. Alright. Um, Jumon Yowakunaru. Yes. Jumon Kieta. Yes, it has. Okay. <laughs> Oh, the music. Pretty good. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Quiz time. <clears throat> okay, so we have Yokoso. Obviously, welcome. Mina-san. Just, you know, everyone. Guran Chiruda no Quizisho no Jikanja. Okay, so that's kind of a declarative at the end, isn't it? So it's like, yeah. Uh, just literally, you know, it's kind of, it is the time of Grunty's quiz show. Oh, that's weird. Okay. Honjitsu no Challenger. Oh, Challenger. What? Banjo to Kazui. Um, that's funny. This Honjitsu is like, means the very day, this very day, today. Um, but it's it's usually a she with a daku ten, uh, hon jitsu. Um, now I don't think this is really pronounced any differently actually, but it's this is not the correct spelling. I think possibly the chi with a daku ten has a slightly more like kind of rough, uh, slightly maybe a stronger kind of j sound to it but I don't I don't think it does actually um, but it could do Honjitsu anyway that's the wrong spelling I think trying to make her sound I don't know man oh, who knows why maybe just for fun but yeah Honjitsu no Challenger what so today's challenges uh, Banjo and Kazooie of course <laughs> uh, Oku no Wana ya tori. Kuria sare, okay. Um, <clears throat> so this is the adverb form of oi, meaning numerous, many. Um, it becomes oku, and then na. I guess it just needs to be an adverb, so you can put no on it. Oku no wana. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why. Uh, can Can you say oi wana? It's, it's, for some reason, it feels a bit less natural. I don't know why. Oi wana ya. Yeah, it doesn't. I feel like oi has to be at the end of the sentence if you want to use it in that form. So, yeah, maybe maybe you can't put it before a word like that. Yeah. Huh, interesting. Anyway, orkuno wana. Wana is just like traps. And ya is obviously like a... Um, uh, well, it's sort of a, it's sort of like an et cetera. It's, it's like an et cetera and, isn't it? It's like uh, 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 traps and tricks, et cetera. Things like traps and tricks is kind of what ya is, isn't it? Or kuria sare. Um, 
this is interesting uh, clear like to clear something like to clear a game to clear uh you know to get past uh, uh traps and tricks um without coming to harm you know to clear them to get past them but she's saying sare um which is the passive form of suru well almost saredu is the passive form but she's only using the stem because the sentence isn't finished but the point i want to focus on here is that it's passive and i feel like passive language just is more polite it's kind of would sound weird as a translation because it as an english translation we would say like you know they they have been cleared many traps and you know tricks but it has it doesn't do that in japanese it just makes it more kind of polite i think yeah i think that's all that's going on it's just if you use the passive form it 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 kind of i suppose kind of accuses the person of uh doing the actions it sort of makes it more polite in that they they the action was done <laughs> i don't know it's 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 just more polite basically passive um so i think her in in the capacity of like a quiz show host she's being this pol using this polite language um cuz it's just kind of proper not yeah yeah she's just kind of committing to that kind of quiz show role and using the proper language that would be needed for it um koko made so until here tadori tsukarete um so again that's the passive form so tadori tsuku is to kind of manage to get to somewhere it's like to oh it's like to go on like a a treacherous journey and to ultimately arrive somewhere at the end of it is kind of tadori tsuku um but again in the capacity of a quiz show host she's using the more proper way of talking which is tadori tsukareru but of course it's the te form because the sentence needs to continue on after it oh no no it's because it's got shimatta at the end <laughs> so, so that's that's pretty good man i like that shimatta so even though she's doing this proper language she is still sort of putting her own feelings into the sentence so she's sort of saying that they have undesirably you know managed to make it this far and obviously from her point of view she didn't want us to get this far so yeah that's kind of that's kind of that's quite funny and then noja um isn't really anything it doesn't really mean anything it's just kind of a a vibe changer <laughs> and then shikash so however and then koko de like at this place oh wa koko de wa at this place as opposed to other places i guess washi ga i will win katsu is to win isn't it so <laughs> banjo wa yabure um so banjo yabure is to like break i guess or to to oh no yabu yabure yabureru yeah that's to break isn't it hold on let me just check that it might yeah i think it is to break it could be like to lose to be defeated or whatever but sort of similar meanings anyway i guess um yabure Oh yeah, no, sorry, to be defeated, yeah, to be defeated. Okay. So Banjo will, you know, become defeated, I guess. And then Washiwa utsukushiku. And again, there's no verb here, but it's kind of like an I will beautifully is a bit literal, but I I suppose Washiwa utsukushiku naru, I will become beautiful kind of thing. I will be beautiful. Um <laughs> Look at <laughs> the other prizes. <laughs> Brilliant. Ichio uh shohin wa yoishita. Oh okay, Ichio, that's sort of that's good. Um 
Ichio. I find it really hard to use. Sometimes it's in a sentence and I don't know why it's in there. But Ichio is kind of like just in case, tentatively, you know. I suppose Ichio kind of means even though you don't really plan to do something, you kind of have done it anyway, just in case kind of thing, um, I feel. But it has a lot of definitions to it that don't really help much. Like tentatively is one of them. In outline, for the time being, just in case. So it kind of covers a lot, Ichio. But obviously in this case, it's like <clears throat> yoi suru is to prepare things. So she, and as past tense, so she has prepared um, some prizes, shohin you know, like this, and that, you know, well, all of them, I suppose. <clears throat> but she doesn't really plan to use them. It's just Ichio, you know, just for the sake of it, kind of, you know, just for, uh, yeah, just just in case um, I've prepared some, um, you know, some prizes. But she doesn't obviously plan to lose, so it, it's, it's, it doesn't... <clears throat> Yeah, so it's just kind of, yeah, just in case kind of thing. Chuti ya nui gurumi doremo steki. Okay, that's weird that that's long. But yeah, I think that's just the word steki at the end, meaning lovely. Yeah, kind of just, yeah, lovely, nice, um, pleasant, you know, just lovely, as, you know, probably is quite a UK uh definition uk based definition but yeah uk english but um yes yeah, stecky lovely kind of thing so tutti again we've got this ya here so tutti and you know the the nui gurumi which i think is like a sewn gurumi what's a gurumi nui gurumi if i get kanji for it <clears throat> yeah it's okay so it's just like a like literally by the kanji it's like a it's like a sewn or a knitted a knit a knitted like parcel or like package and it's it's just a mass maybe a knitted mass that then obviously it is then put into like the shape of a well in in the west a, a bear or a toy you know it's just a, a, a plush toy or whatever and then doremo just meaning you know uh Whichever you go with, any of them are, you know, all, therefore, that kind of means all of them are lovely. Yeah, they're all lovely. Dake <coughs> um, just meaning like, but, omaya wa kuizu ni yabure. Um, so, yeah, you, uh, I guess, in the quiz will be defeated or be, be defeated by the quiz? Chuti <laughs> no tokoro made. So until the place of Tuti, or you know, uh, to Tuti, basically, to the place where Tuti is. Tadori tsukenai. Um, so again, we've got Tadori tsuku, meaning to manage to get to. And this time it's sort of the negative potential form. So Tadori tsukenai. Um, you know, you will not be able to manage to get to the place where Tuti is. <coughs> Nayami kurushimu sono sunata de. Okay, Nayamu is, I think, to. Nayamu is to be kind of stressed out, isn't it? It's to be worried uh stressed out kind of i suppose mentally uh, what's the word mentally mentally pained <laughs> might be a definition uh, a translation and then kurushimu is also kind of to suffer but i think that's in a more general sense i think that can be physical and and or mental 
but I think Nayama is just mental. But yeah, anyway, it's like, you know, suffer, suffer sort of thing. Um, sono sungata de, in that form or something. Okay, washi wa saiko ni uh, goki gen ni. Okay, so I think actually the previous half of this sentence was um, sono sungata de. It's kind of like due to the sungata, which is the form, due to the form of you suffering. Um, I will kind of um, uh, saiko ni. I will you know, to the greatest extent, I suppose, um, become joyful, I guess, be in a good mood. So, uh, I, th I think that's sort of what it is. Gorky again. It's like, yeah, in a good mood, in high spirits, pleasant. Yeah, so she's sort of saying like, um, and again, there's no verb at the end here, I think. Uh, maybe again, it should be naru, gorky gen ni naru. Like, I will become into great, you know, in a good mood, high spirits, um, from, you know, due to your suffering form. <laughs> so less literally, you know, I will take great pleasure in watching you suffer. Saigo ni omae wa maguma no no oh no naka okay that was <laughs> okay yeah saigo ni omae wa maguma no naka so you know in the end or finally at the very end you um basically like within the magma isn't it within the lava so yeah Uh, okay, excellent. And saigo ni shohin wa washi no te no naka. Um, so also at the very end, the prize is my hand, like inside. Um, so yeah, you will be in the lava and all the prizes will be in my hands is kind of the, kind of the vibe there. Sore demo... Idomu nara, sa banjo. Um, so yeah, sore demo is kind of like um, despite, despite all of that, sore demo. Yeah, even that, you know, even given that, I think. Idomu nara, idomu is to like uh, to. Um, what is idomu? I feel like I've translated this well in the past. Idomu is to challenge, you know, to give something a go, to, yeah, to give something a go, basically, to try hard to overcome something. And then nara is just a conditional, so if you intend to, you know, continue and give it a go, despite all of that, or even given all of that, sa banjo, just literally now banjo, just sort of addressing us. <coughs> okay. Paneru ni notte. So, you know, board onto the panels or, you know, step onto a panel. E botan wo. And again, no verb here, but just e botan wo. You don't need the verb, obviously. It, it means to press the A button. So we don't need the verb. Uh, what's going on here? Oish. Okay. Oh, okay. Couldn't change the camera there. It's a bit, a bit weird. Oh, God. Um, oh, all right. <laughs> She's saying she she forgot to to mention something. Um, chokotto washi ga do war do wasure I guess I guess this must just mean do wasure is to just have completely forgotten something. Um, oh, lapse of memory. Yeah, forgetting for a moment something one knows well, slipping one's mind, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I see. Do wasure. And that seems to be, <clears throat> well, the suru makes it into a verb, but do wasure seems to be a a noun, usually. And I guess chokotto is just a bit like, um, you know, chotto, like a little, or wait a second kind of thing. Or maybe to a small extent, to a little amount, 
ちょこっとわしが、so yeah, to a small amount, I completely forgot something, or I forgot something small that I need to mention. <coughs> And then, Kono Gamer Nitsui Teno Quizuja. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, okay, I see.、Um, so, Nitsui t e means to like be about or to be concerned with. So, it's like、um, about, well, I suppose we are going backwards. We're sort of saying like it's a quiz. The no is just needed there grammatically to link. Nitsui te to the quiz, so it's yeah, just it's a quiz about this game, is 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 all is all that's being said. All right, let's get them. <clears throat> wow, that's kind of fast. Um, Kusari, Kusari, Kusari de Tsunagareta Kujira. Oh, of course, Kusari. Kusari's a chain. Yeah, yeah, okay. Kusari, I was confused then.、Uh, Kusari de Tsunagareta Kujira no Kuranka. <coughs> so, yeah.、Um, it's like Klanka the whale. Is it a whale? Kujira? Is he a whale? I thought he was a shark. Okay, fine. Anyway. Okay, so Klanka the whale,、um, you know,、uh, kind of、uh, connected. By a chain. Oh god. Kusari wa nani ni kotei sareteita. So the chain.、Um, to what? And then kotei is, I think, just to be kind of. to be affixed, to be stuck in place.、Um, I know that, like. They often use the word kote in like the settings for games that have mini maps because you can kote the mini map to be, you know, always pointing north. Rather, or you can have it not kote and it will rotate as you turn your character, which I hate. <laughs> I prefer the mini map to be koteed so it's always to the north.、Um, And then obviously the passive form of the verb sudu here,、uh, just to make that into a verb. So, it, you know, to be affixed. So, to what was the chain affixed?、Uh, oh, God.、Uh, okina o nabe. Okina o nabe. So, that sounds like a, you know, a large, like, cooking pot, which I don't think is the correct answer.、Um, okina kinzoku no buroku. Um, which is just, you know, again, a large metal block or an Okina Marui Ishi. What the hell? Really? Like a large round stone. It's just a Kinzoku Baroku, isn't it? I don't even know, man. Let's see. Okay, good. <laughs> Boo. They're booing me. Um, see, like, here's where it just doesn't. This is an example of when Ichio just doesn't make any sense to me. Ichio, okay. I, I, like, I don't know what that means. Like, in, before it was obviously, you know, just in case. But this time. May, well, actually, I suppose maybe it's like for the time being, you're okay. Ichio, okay. Yeah, maybe, it, maybe it's that in this time. I don't know, man. It's such a weird word. I, I hate Ichio. I have to practice using it.、Um, anyway, lucky, Dana. So, you know, you are lucky, aren't you? It's kind of the vibe there. Tama Tama Yamakan. Atadana. Really? Tama Tama, I think, is like, you know, from time to time. Every now and then. Yamakan. I have to look that up. Oh! Oh, that's really good. I like that word. Yamakan is guesswork or speculation. <laughs> that's great. I, I didn't know that. I, I like that word. Yamakan. And then atatta. So I, I, I think we've seen this before. Ataru is to hit upon the spot or to. 
hit a bullseye or to yeah make contact with it has quite a few different meanings but yeah atatta just means you know that's past tense just means you 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 know you got the right answer obviously you know th- uh, through guesswork um or get or from time to time guesswork also hits upon the correct answer sort of, sort of thing all right there we go um, shashin no quizda, so literally just photo quiz with a declarative, so it's a photo quiz kind of thing. Uh, me wo akero. Um, that's the imperative of akeru, meaning to open, and me is eyes, so it's like open your eyes, you know. And then doko to ka, dare to ka, kotaero ya. Um, so doko is where. Toka is just kind of like what is Toka? It's kind of like etc. again, I feel. It's like where etc. Whom etc. Um Kotaeroya. And then Kotaero is again the imperative of Kotairu, meaning to answer. And then Yo just adds a bit of force, uh, a bit of strength. Or changes the vibe, basically, a little bit. Um Tsugi no Camera o mirugai. Um, so tsugi is next, so next camera. Um, mirugai is like just, you know. Well, it's kind of what? Just like an order to look at the next camera? Or I guess the thing she's about to show us? Um, kore ni. Wa okay, kore ni wa. So in this, dare ga utsuteru. Um, so who um, is kind of being projected? Utsuru is kind of to be projected, to be pictured, isn't it? So utsuteru is just the present continuous. Who is being? Who is projecting? <laughs> um, Oh, he burnt. Excellent. That's nub nuts. So we have gabu nuts, nabu nuts, and dobu nuts. And I don't know if any of those are, <laughs> are jokes or what. Um, kan kyaku ta chi wa. Uh, kan kyaku is literally like. Kan is the kanji for like um, observing or watching, and kyaku is guest, so it's spectators basically. Um, the spectators, and then that's pluralizing it. So spectators, uh, the spectators are boo, boo, boo. Um, so they're saying, you know, obviously they're saying boo, boo. They're jeering us, if that's the right word. I don't even know English. Um, Omae ga misusulia yorokobunja. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, misu is, I guess, you know, to make a mistake or to miss the answer or something like that. But to mess up, basically, is miss, isn't it? And then sulia is um, sureba, but just kind of pronounced differently. So it's a conditional. So um, if you mess up, basically, uh, yeah, if you mess up, uh, yorokobu is to be happy. So she's still talking about the spectators there. She's saying, if you mess up, they will happy. They will be happy. They will joy. Because yorokobu is a verb, right? So it's like, yeah, they will joy, they will happy kind of thing. And then unja is just, you know, <clears throat> a slight vibe changer. Damn it. <laughs> so much text here. Okay. Sonna hachimitsu hirottemo. Okay, so such um, honeycomb. Uh, and then hiro is to pick up. Hirot demo is like even if kind of even yeah even if you pick up such honey combs um, kito chuti wa taskaran uh, kito meaning just you know uh, for sure tuti um, and taskaran kind of taskaranai would be like will not be helped will not be saved. It's an intransitive verb. Very natural in Japanese to use this intransitive verb, but not so much in English. But yeah, um, for sure, Tuti will not be helped. 
or you know more naturally english wise it would be like you know for, you know you you cannot help Tutti. you cannot save her <coughs> i guess we better do a a grunty one um kono subarai subarashiki washi no koto o um i don't think uh putting ki at the end of any adjective instead of an e changes it really i think it's just kind of old language it's like an old form um so i don't think subarashiki is really any different to sub subarashi other than the fact that if you said subarashiki nowadays it would probably sound a little odd because um because you shouldn't be using it but in games and stuff like that you know it works well i don't know man it probably has its place but i don't think meaning wise it it, it, it is any different um and this put in Kono before referring to yourself, I think somehow displays arrogance. Um, I don't really know why, but it's kind of, if you say Kono Ore, it's like somehow you'll say, you know, this me. I don't know why, but it seems to display arrogance somehow. Um, so she's saying this, you know, fantastic me. Uh, no koto. So it's kind of facts and information related to her is, is sort of what she's saying. No koto o. Um, so facts related to the fabulous me. <laughs> okay. Dore dake benkyo shitaka tameshite yaro. Um, so dore dake is sort of like precisely how much, I guess. Benkyo shita is just, you know, how much did you learn? And then this is like cut making all of that into a kind of a question onto which we can do another verb or upon which we can do another verb. So it's like, let's test precisely how much did you learn might be a good, um, a good equivalent English sentence. But, you know, again, a bit weird sounding in the English, you know. Let's test precisely how much did you learn. Sounds a bit weird as English, but uh, that's sort of how the Japanese is working here. Um, washi ga majo skuru de. I'm going to have forgotten all of this information. Uh, I I want to remember it, but I don't think I'm going to. Um, so at you know which is school I ichiban datta no wa. Nani ka atete mido. So, um, at which is school, I was, I kind of was number one. No, 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 no. It's kind of the being number one. Oh, how do you translate that? Ichiban datta no wa. Nani ka. Um, at which is school. I don't know how to translate that. It's, it's all too muddled. Washi ga majo skuru de ichiban datta no wa nani ka. Washi ga. Oh man. I was number. The, the I was. It's kind of the I was number one at witch's school was what kind of it's kind of that sort of order but you know in natural english just like what was i the best at at which is school and then ateru is uh oh excuse me my legs got dead boy um ateru is to try to hit something it's 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 the transitive form of ataru Ataru is to... Oh, that, this... Anyway, it doesn't really matter, I guess. But yeah, it's basically she's saying, um, you know, uh, try to hit upon the correct answer. Try, You know, guess. I use this quite a lot during classes, I will say. Um, you know, like, atete. It means to, to try to, you know, to guess, to try to hit the correct answer. 
Um, oh yeah, I need to pause. Uh, so Kutsushitaka Kusai Koto. Um, so the socks were, yeah, like like having smelly socks. I suppose is what Koto does. The fact, the fact of, or the phenomenon maybe the phenomenon of smelly socks is what she was best at. Or Pantsuga Kitanai Koto. So the phenomenon of having. Yeah, the phenomenon of dirty pants. And then Oshiri ga okii koto um, is the phenomenon of, you know, uh, a, a big a, a big bum, a large bum. And I, I can't remember. I don't think it was, I don't think it was socks. Oshiri ga okii. I think it was pants, wasn't it? Yes. Quite oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Sonna Himitsu wo Naze Shiteru. Um so such a secret. Why are you knowing? Or more naturally, of course, how do you know um such a secret? <laughs> Satewa. I don't know why that is. Satewa. Satewa. I, d I really don't know. It, it, I mean, it, in context, I guess it must mean. Um, well, actually, I do have a I do have an entry in my dictionary, and then besides, on top of that, sate wa burenchiru da me. So burenchiru da obviously is her sister, just um, uh, just her name, and then me at the end expresses hatred for that which it follows, right? So it's just, you know, without getting too crude, it's like that, that, that darned Brenty is kind of a, maybe a translation there. Um, and then Shabetta, like she, she talked, she told you, didn't she, sort of thing. Um, satewa, I don't know Satewa. Maybe, maybe it's like, you know, how did you know such a secret? And then, you know, uh, from your knowing such a secret, I can, I can infer that Brenty must have talked or something like that. Um, yeah, I don't know. We shouldn't. I guess I shouldn't worry too much about things. Um, how many? There's a lot of. <laughs> there's so many questions. All right. Probably not going to do them all then. Um, sabi sabi minato na kuren ga. Okay, so you know, rust rust ports. Well, rust rust ports crane. Ga. <laughs> um, tsuri sageta hako no nakami wa nanja. Okay. Yeah, okay. Tsuri sageta. Well, sageru is to descend, isn't it? So tsuri sa well, tsuri is to suspend or to hang. So tsuri sageru, I guess, is to either to sort of to lower down like a, like a crane would do. You know, a crane, obviously something would hang off of a crane and then you lower it if if we're saying sageru so tsuri sageta hako so the box lowered by the crane in rusty bucket bay uh and then no nakami so the contents nakami is contents so the contents of the box lowered in rust by the crane in rusty bucket bay was what nanja what were the contents <laughs> oh um <laughs> what what is that middle answer? Okay, one up ga mitsu. So obviously three extra lives. Uh Guran Chirida no stereo combo. Um So yeah, Grunty's like, I don't know, stereo combo, I guess just some kind of Is that combo or compo? I don't think it's compo, is it? 
I guess it just means like grunty stereo, just a stereo system or something. Um, let me put coal in and see if that, no, that doesn't return anything. Compo isn't a word, is it? Hold on. Oh yeah, 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 it is component, component stereo. I don't know what that means. But anyway, it's obviously, it's not that. TNT Bakudan, just literally, you know, TNT um, exploding bullet or TNT bomb, um, which is what it was, right? There weren't any others in the level, were there? Okay, fine. Um, I don't like these. I don't want to do these. Um, Akushon Charenji no Jikan desu. So literally, you know, it is time of the action challenge, it's time for the action challenge. Tai Ryoku Kezurare Boro Boro ni Kezuru. Kezuru is to kind of shave away at health, it is shave away at something, isn't it? I think. Like, I guess maybe sanding something down would be Kezuru. Or to kind of maybe. I don't know, actually. I, th I think that is right. But I don't know, sort of, is it to scrape off, to cut down, to whittle, uh, to sharpen. It's sort of to, you know, to shave bits off or to, yeah, that sort of thing. Um, so, taiyoku kezudare, so that's the passive form. And taiyoku is, in the game, the video game sense, it's your health. Um, so your health will be kind of shaved down. So I guess, you know, the point is that we slowly lose our honeycombs or whatever by doing these challenges. And then boro boro, boro boro ni. I'm, I'm, I might be getting muddled, that muddled up with boko boko. Yeah, boro boro, okay, worn out, torn, crumbling. So yeah, just, yeah, you'll, you'll sort of, you know, get worn down by the challenge, I guess, or, or something. Um, I don't want to do it. Uh, it looks like we can't avoid it, though. Can I get a first person? Yeah, it looks like either way we have to do a time challenge, right? Okay. Let's do it, then. Oh, okay. <coughs> Ruru no henko suna no shiro. Okay. So, uh, this is like a, um, a rules changed sandcastle. So, you know, the sandcastle, but this time where the rules are different. Subayaku sakasa ni uchikome yo. Subayaku, I guess it's just like, you know, as well, quickly, basically. Sakasa is like opposite. Um, I think, or upside down. Um, so I guess Sakasa ni is just, we, we want to enter the code, Banjo-Kazooie, but in reverse. So starting with E, then I, then Z, and then double up. Wait, that's not right, is it? <laughs> e, then I, then O, then O, then Z, then A. Yeah, okay. And then Uchikomu. Utsu is to like, hit things to strike things um and then komu is just sort of comes after a lot of verbs to mean like hammer in in this case like hammer into just kind of means into uh, and then yo just adding like force uh, or changing the vibe a bit is that actually what we're doing okay can sort of see why they put it on the wall this time, actually, can't you? Uh, Z. Did I see it? Where's Z? There it is. Oh my gosh. We don't have a lot of time, do we? Where's the K? There it is. I need a J. J, J, J. There it is. I need another A. There it is. Okay. Maybe you do have. Never mind. That was, that was a lot of time. Yosh. Okay, I like these picture ones. <laughs> okay. 
OK、わしの写真を見るがいい。これはどこで、OK、これはどこで写したか。うつす is the transitive of うつる。Earlier we saw who is うつっている、who is pictured.、Um, but うつす is the transitive, so it's kind of to picture, to take a photo or to, or to I guess maybe even to film. But yeah, これは、so this, どこで、at where,、um, you know,、uh, was this picture u t s u s h t u d Where did, where was this picture taken?、Uh, looks like Clanker's Cavern. And I guess we're just going to have level names. g u r a n c h i r i d a no Tori de, Sabi Sabi Minato, k u r a n k a no d o k u t s u which is the answer. <laughs> お宝ザクザクビーチなスナのシロ。そうや、トレジャートローブコーブズサンドカーソル。パネルになかったアルファベットは、Good Lord、um,。That's really hard, man.、Uh, well, actually, I suppose we won't know until we see the answers, but yeah.、Um, so it's like the alphabet. Uh, nakata is just the past, well, negative past of to exist, isn't it? So, what was not, or yeah, well, actually, the what isn't even isn't even asked, but it would be there. So, in the on the panel,、um, like which alphabet was not,、um, so which letter was missing. Crap. I really don't know. I guess X. <laughs> Damn. Was there not a Q? I don't know. Ha 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 ha. Oh, I should have, I should have save stated it just to see what the correct answer was. Machi gatta ra itai daro. So literally, just, you know, if you make a mistake, it's painful, isn't it? Ha <laughs> ha. まだやめないなら A ボタン。So,、um, like, not yet,、um, uh, not stop if, or, you know, if, if, if you're still not going to stop, you know, press the A button again, sort of thing. Oh, I should have checked that answer, I don't know. クランカの洞窟の海の底。海 is ocean. And then Soko is like the very bottom. So at the, at the bottom of the ocean of Clanker's Cavern. Oh, God. So, like, oh, man. Awa o dasu sakana no namayo wa nanja. So, awa is bubbles, dasu is to, to get out, to produce, I suppose. So, the bubble producing fish. Uh, uh, sorry, a fish's name. So the bubble producing fish's name is what? A glooper, wasn't it? Gurub. Gurub. Yeah, I think it's Gurub. I think it's Gurub. Yes. Yeah, music time. Um, Sound or Quizda. So, yeah, literally, sound quiz. It's a sound quiz. Nimi o fusage. Fusagu is to be blocked, it's intransitive.、Um, so, yeah, fusagu is a, it means to be blocked.、Um, so, this is.、Huh? Wait, am I, am I right? Fusage? She's telling us to block our ears. To stop, I thought I was expecting the opposite. To stop up, to close up, to block up, to occupy. Huh. Mimi o Fusage. Well, I guess she doesn't want us to win or whatever, right? So maybe that's why. So yeah, it's like,、um, that's the imperative, of course, Fusage.、Um, so、uh, block up your ears. <laughs> yeah, okay, she is. She's trying to. She's trying to. Get us to、uh, not hear the answer, I see.、Uh, volume, obviously just volume. Sagete.、Um, we saw that 
uh, with the crane thing, sageru is to lower. So lower the volume, <laughs> machigairo, and, you know, uh, answer incorrectly, you know, make make a mistake. That's just the imperative again, machigairo. <laughs> Uh, yoku kite erabu no ja. So carefully listen uh, and select, basically. Uh, listen carefully and then choose. <laughs> Kono steki na koe wa dare no koe. So this lovely uh, voice, koe is voice, wa dare no koe. Um, uh, whose voice? <laughs> course it's her. Majo no Guran Chiruda, yo se no Buren Chiruda. Wait a minute. Yo se. And then Kuma no Chuti. Ku huh? Kuma no Chuti. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, it's just because it was his hair that was putting me off. Um, yeah. So, uh, Tootie the Bear, uh, Grunty the Witch, or Brenty the Something. You'll see. Is that, is that an insect? I think that's an insect. You'll see is the grubs, isn't it? Oh, no, sorry. No, I'm completely wrong. What am I talking about? Um, you'll see is the fa it's fairy. I should really know that, having done Zelda as much as I have. Uh, you'll see no Brenty the so Brenty the fairy. What am I thinking of then? Might as well look it up now. Oh, it's Yol Chu, is it? Yeah, Yol Chu is what I'm thinking of. Lava. Chrysalis. The sort of like. Oh, that's disgusting. Anyway, there we go. Right. Um, I do. I kind of want to test my knowledge on on. A grunty. Washi no itsumono dinner waha. Okay, so my always dinner, or my standard dinner, or my, you know, the dinner I have all the time. Uh, Goka de oishi. Um, I don't know if we've covered this, but uh, this is a na adjective, goka. And so when you want to list multiple adjectives together, you, you use de after na adjectives so go kade and then we've got another adjective after it which in this case is an e adjective which doesn't affect anything it's just going to be oishi um but yeah so that dare there is just how you it's just what you put after not adjectives when you've got multiple um adjectives sorry wa nanja uh so referring to that the thing I just mentioned, the, the dinner that I have all the time. Uh, what is that? What is it? Uh, namekuji no shiju. Okay. Namekuji no shiju. I don't know that. Some kind of stew. Uh, tokage no steki. Um, so that's lizard steak. And then ujimushi no pai. I've got to look up this. This is all going to be disgusting. Um, Uji Mushi. Uji Mushi is maggot <laughs> or worm, used figuratively as a term of abuse, apparently. Um, and then we have Na Me Kuji, which is slug. Damn, gross. Uh, so, slug stew, lizard steak. Or what was it again? It was like maggot pie, wasn't it? I don't remember. Have we even seen this? I'm gonna go with the lizard steak. Oh, nice. Maybe we have seen it then. <laughs> um, I feel like I'd better get a Joker space. There's one up there. I don't really need to. I don't really need to do that one. Uh oh. Um, kono mondai wa machigaya na? Oh, machigaya na. Machigaya na? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay, that makes sense to me. Sorry, yeah, I was a bit confused then. Um, 
So Conor Mondai, this problem, uh, and then while obviously referring to this problem, talking about this, or question, I should say, this question. Um, Machigaya, nah. There's this thing that uh, I think is kind of quite friendly <laughs> or, or casual in Japanese, where you say the stem of the verb, and then you put na at the end. And it's just kind of... It's kind of the same as, like, saying... Machigayete. Ne. Machigayete ne. You know, like, make a mistake. But machigaya na. It's just kind of a more casual way of saying that. Like, you know, mess this one up, yeah? Kind of thing. Bit casual, bit... Um, yeah, not, not too, like, serious or not too... Yeah, just not too serious of a vibe. Just kind of a casual kind of vibe. <laughs> magma no ofuro o presento. Uh, magma, obviously magma. No ofuro. Ofuro is a, a bath. Um, again, I guess furo is bath, but it's one of those words that, again, often has an honorific on it. Ofuro. Most people will put the honorific on. Um, and then presento, which I guess is just, you know, a present. Um, yeah. So mess this question up, uh, your present will be a, 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 a magma bath. Uh-oh. Oh, wrong, wrong button. So again, washi no shashi no miru ga ii, look at my picture. Ba-ba-ba, uh, kore wa douko de utsushita ka. This, uh, at where was it taken? Oh god. Oh god, I don't want to get this wrong. What is that? That's rust. That's got to be Rusty Bucket, right? There's like metal floor. There's coal, which I assume would be put into the engines. I don't want to get it wrong. Can I save state? Can I save state? <laughs> Is anyone going to be angry if I save state? I don't want to lose progress. Um... Oh, okay. Fine. Doesn't matter anyway. I didn't say I didn't say state, guys. I, I did. I did. Um, washi no itsumo no asa gohan no. Okay, so my um, you know, usual I suppose uh, breakfast. Shitteru ka? You know, are you knowing my usual breakfast or do you know my usual breakfast? Um, oh, whoops, wrong button. Dobu nezumi no donuts. So that's just... Dobu nezumi, that's just like... I don't think that means anything. Dobu nezumi, I think it's just a, a, a rat. Just rat donut. Um, otama jakushi no toast. Jesus. So tadpole toast. Um, or doku gumo no pancake. I remember that. I remember that one. Yeah, it must be that. Uh, so, yeah, just like venomous spider pancake, uh, I guess. Uh, did we discuss that before? I don't know if doku... Like, in English, obviously, venomous is what you say about things that that bite you and, you know, kind of poison you or whatever. And poison means something that you consume and that then makes you ill. So I don't know if there's that distinction in Japanese for doku. Doku might just mean poisonous and venomous together. But yeah. Um, so venomous spider pancakes is, is the answer. I hope. Because <laughs> I do remember it. So if it's not that, I need to be a bit worried. Um, so yeah, I guess we'll just try and go to all the grunty squares. Uh, Kujira no Kuranka wo Tasketa Toki. Um, yeah, okay. So, Clanka the whale helped time, or when you helped Clanka the whale. Omaya wa oyoide nani o kugutta ka. So, yeah, I guess like kuguru or whatever. I think it's kuguru. Kuguru is to kind of go through something, to pass through something. And so, sort of, you um, swam, um, um, uh, and and through what did you pass, kind of thing. What did you swim through is kind of a more natural question. 
uh, okina tube, so a big tube, okina kagi, a big key, or okina ringu, a big ring. And it was, of course, a big key. Washi no shashi no miru ga i. Kore wa doko de utsushita ka. That must also be Rusty Bucket, right? Man, they've all just been Rusty Bucket, I think. What is that noise? It's Clanker. Washi no shashi no miru ga i. Kore wa doko de utsushita ka. That'll be that snowman level. What was it called again? Zun Zun Ya Furo Zun Zun Yama, wasn't it? There it is. Furo Zun Zun Yama. Kono Oh, okay. Kono BGM. So obviously this background music. Dono stage na tema datta. Um so yeah, which stages theme? it was yeah that's interesting like tema is for some reason how they say theme in japanese i don't know why it's got that pronunciation but there you go tema but uh, yeah it's just interesting to me that they also use it for music tema the theme because they they use it for like a theme i guess in like a design sense as well huh <clears throat> Oh, that's um, Click Clock Wood, isn't it? Chikutaku na Mori. Oh, that's just got different... No, it was, was it Chikutaku? No, it was Kachikochi, wasn't it? Damn, I almost, I almost missed that up, man. Um, Achikochi na Mori. Okay, so they've just got a slightly different, like... Uh, variation on the name of the level to try and catch you out. So chiktaku namori, achikochi namori, achikochi is like here and there. It's like in various places. It's or, you know, maybe in the sense of like being encountered occasionally, but in various places, achikochi, it's like it's here and there in the world rather than expressing lots of frequency. Um, but yeah, kachikochi is kachikochi, right? Okay, good. Grunty. <clears throat> Gekkan debu obaba no hyoshi wo kazatta toki. I don't know what's going on here. Gekkan debu obaba no hyoshi. Hyoshi? Hyoshi? Is that like that's... What's Hy Hyoshi is like the, the cover page, isn't it, of a book? Or oh, kazatta toki. Kazaru is to decorate. What's gekkan? I thought I should know that. Gekkan. Oh, okay, yeah, sure. Oh, okay, well, yeah, okay, fine, fine, fine. Of course it is, yeah. So Gekkan is a, a monthly publication. Yeah, all right, okay, so and that's the name of it, Debu or Baba. Um, so the monthly publication, uh, kind of fat old bags or something. Not Hyoshi, the cover page. All right, okay, I see. Or Kozatta Toki. So when or at the time that i decorated the front page of the monthly publication you know fat old bags oh my god really washi wa donna pose datta ka so i what kind of pose was like what kind of pose did i do oh my gosh or what kind of I don't know, man. Dekai pants sungata. So I guess you were just in your huge pants. 
hōki ni matangata pōzu. Matagaru. Let's have a look at that. Matagaru is to to straddle, basically. Hōki ni matangata pōzu. So, um, on the broom, um, straddle, straddled pose, a straddled on the broom pose. Um, and sui sho damam, dama migaki. Oh, that sounds right. That sounds right for some reason. Um, sui sho is like a, is, is a crystal ball, I believe, right? Sui sho. Sui sho. I think that is, yeah, crystal. And then Dama is just like, you know, makes it a ball. So yeah, uh, crystal ball Migaku. Migaku is to like polish or to, you know, to to rub or whatever. So I guess she, I guess she was, you know, um, polishing her crystal ball, which I think is right. Oh, I was scared then. Okay, chance wa ichido kono panel. Um Ichido kono panel. I don't really know what's going on here. You know, this panel is like, you know I don't know. You have one chance. I don't know man. I don't know what that means really. Joka Toreba Rakuchinda. Okay. So if you take the Joker or if you get a Joker, I guess. Rakuchin. Does that just mean like to be relaxed? Yeah, kind of easy going, easy life. I feel like we've seen that before, but I don't know where. Okay. Um, gobi bare sabaku na piramido kara nagare dete. Okay. Um, so gobi valley deserts pyramids from so from the pyramids of Gobi's valley. Um, nagare dete uh, to sort of flow out. Ohori o manpai ni. Stamonoa. Manpai, is that just like to f to become full? Yeah, full, okay, fine. Ohori wo manpai ni stamonoa. So, kind of what was it that came out of the pyramids in Gobi's Valley and um, made the whole like full fills filled the hole i don't know why there's an honorific on this oh hori isn't hori enough i'll just have a look just to make sure there's nothing no no it's just got an honorific for some reason i wonder why it's just water though wasn't it mira that's that's mummies mira is like you know in the egyptian sense of course mummies um Mizu is water and Suna is sand. It was just water, wasn't it? That's easy. Joka torete ureshika. So, um, you know, kind of, yeah. Um, are you happy that you were able to get a Joker? Were you happy that you were able to take a Joker? Um, panel o hitotsu pasu dekiru. Um, so yeah, kind of just one panel pass can. You can pass one panel. But, well, actually two, right? Because we have two of them. Okay, sky tai nara bibota. So if you want to use, or yeah, if you want to use it, press B. Sonna inch, inchiki, inchiki. Hmm. I guess it's oh cheating, <laughs> cheating fake bogus 
ok, ha. Sonna inchki skau nayo. So, you know, that's just, at skau is to use, and then with na at the end is just the negative imperative. So don't use such a cheating method, I guess. All right. Um, oh, God. <laughs> There's quite a lot of death squares there. That's, uh... Whoops. Okay. So we got uh, uh, <laughs> Mad Mansion no Yashiki no Naka ni. Okay. Um, so, yeah, uh, uh, what was it even called? Mad Monster Mansion. Uh, Mad Monster Mansion's Mansion. Inside. So, inside Mad Monster Mansion's Mansion. Uh, okay. No, no, sorry, not inside, but into the inside. Into the inside of Mad Monster Mansion's mansion. <laughs> um, kind of uh, how many existed methods of entering is kind of the... So how many ways in were there, basically? Haidu ho ho. Methods, en entering methods. How many existed? How many were there? Two? Wait a minute. No, obviously not two. Um, Q tori, nana tori, hach tori. We could probably try and figure this out. Do they time you on this? Really, they time you for this? So it's just it is a guess, basically. Um, well, there's obviously the front door and the chimney. Was there a window on the ground level? Does the cellar count? There's too much. There's too many factors. There's not enough information. There were a couple. There were a couple of windows on one level, weren't there? Were there? Th I might just. I might just go with nine. Oh, nice. <laughs> Didn't expect that. Um. This feels a bit pointless. I don't think we want to do that. Let's skip that. Um, so we have sonna inchi kitsukatta na. Um, so such a cheat, such a cheating method you used, didn't you? Kind of thing. Hikyo mono no yowamushime. Hikyo mono no. Uh, I guess Hikyo Mono is just a wimp, you know, a, uh, uh, someone without any guts. Um, and then Yowamushi is like a, li you know, it's literally the words like weak, almost, combined with bug. So, yeah, yeah pathetic bug, weak worm. So, yeah. And then Met, just again, kind of expressing hatred at the, the thing that it follows. Um... I didn't need to use that. Oh, never mind. I, I kind of just want to do the grunty squares. Should I even... Should I do them? Maybe maybe I'll just try... That's a lot of death squares. Let's just... Let's try and get to the end. Uh, da, 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 da. <laughs> okay. Kono bakana koe wa dare no koe. So this path this sort of idiotic voice is whose voice? So obviously when it was her voice she said stecky meaning lovely and now that it's someone else's voice she's saying idiotic. Um mumbo obviously. Um Oh look at this, they've got different little names. Uh, majinai, majinai shi, mambo jumbo, majinai shi, funba unba. <laughs> What's that mean? Funba unba. And then majinai shi, uh, jimbo jumbo, <laughs> jimbo jumbo. Okay, mambo jumbo. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, picture time. Uh, 
I don't know where that is. Could it be in Wazza's cave? Like, it's given me kind of Banjo-Tooie vibes. It looks like the caveman's cave, doesn't it? Um, where else would they have a fire like that? It must be Wazza's cave, right? It must be... Fudol Zun Zun Yama. Oh, it's not... Because it's not... It's not the Otter's cave. Because he had it in a fireplace. Did they have... Did he even have a fire in Wazza's cave? There's something moving over there, right? I can't see what that is in the top right. Fudol Zun Zun Yama. Guran Chiruda no Toride. Could it be in Grunty's lair? Or Kachikori, Kachikochi Namori. I think it has to be Frozen Zunyama. Nice. Okay, skip that. Um, yeah. Uh, Mambo, Mambo Mountain na Mizumi de Mizumi. Mizumi is a lake, isn't it? Okay. So Mumbo Mountain's Lake. At Mumbo Mountain's Lake. Gya Gya Urusai Jinjo wa. I guess that just means the colour. Gya Gya, I guess is... Yeah, that must just be onomatopoeic. Gya Gya. Like irritating... Uh, what's the word? Obnoxious, like an obnoxious sound. I mean, I don't think they actually make this noise, but obviously she she <laughs> she considers the the sound that they make to be irritating. So she's kind of using this as a as a way to kind of complain about them. Udusai Jinjo, wasn't it blue? Well, there isn't a black one. Kudoi Jinjo. There isn't a black one. Midori no Jinjo. There's, there, there is. Is there? A, there is a green one, right? And then Aoi Jinjo. I think it's the blue one. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we don't need that. Hmm. That's on the pyramids, right? So that'll be Gobi Bare whatever it was. Gobi Bare Sabaku. Oh, I don't want to do this. Oh fine. Dose Jikan ga Nakunaru ga Dolce. So kind of, is Dolce like any way, anyhow, whatever you do, whatever happens, I don't know. Jikan ga naku naru ga. So no matter what, time will, you know, you'll run out of time, but. Don don kuma wo sashite yare. Uh, I, you know, progressively, one by one, maybe? One by one, you know, stab the bear, basically. Are we supposed to... Oh, okay. So we just got to survive, is that right? Huh. They're not very... Not very accurate. Hey, this is... <laughs> this is quite a good challenge. I love the quiz. What is this? There's no point trying to kill him. I could just... <laughs> You <laughs> just dodge him. Hey, what a, what a great game. Oh, damn. <laughs> Alright. Fine, fine, fine. Uh, motto Miss Shiro. So, um, yeah, additionally, more Miss Shiro. So, mess up more. Uh, Sono Choshi. 
その調子もっとミスしろその調子、uh, 調子 is just like Uh, like an attitude or a, like a, a way of doing things or an attitude towards doing things or something.、Um, so, sono choshi is just like the way we're doing things. So, sono choshi is how we are doing things, how we are acting.、Um, I don't know if she's saying. You will, miss, you will mess up more if you continue in that way, which is obviously what she wants.、Um, or if this is a separate part of the sentence. Kyo no o kyaku wa shiawase ja. Okay, no, no, no. It's not. It was. That was. Sono choshi was part of this sentence. Um, so,、uh, by, you know,、uh, with that attitude acting in that way, today's、um, spectators、uh, will, you know, be happy. s h i a w a s e is like, is happiness, yeah.、Uh, they'll be happy if we continue to mess up as we are, I guess. Oh, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. I don't understand. Didn't we succeed? We survived. Kono tatakai ni kateru kana. So, this battle,、um, like, can you win? I wonder. Sei gen jikan mo tsuitaru zo. So, just kind of limited or a. Yeah, say again. Yeah, just a limit, I suppose. A limit time. Also,、um, is attached or you know, is included, I guess.、Um, probably. I don't understand how we failed the last one. We were supposed to kill them all, were we? Oh my god, dude. Fine. Oh, do you know what? Forget it. The eggs. It's not really going better, is it, actually? I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't know how we failed that last one. I thought we were just dodging them. <clears throat> okay, Mumbo Mountain no Mizumi de. O yoi de ita no wa nani datta. So, yeah, O yoi de ita、uh, was swimming, basically. So, what was sw-、um, the swimming was what? Is kind of a terrible, terrible、um, translation, but there you go.、Um, hara peko no same. So, hara peko is like a, a hungry, basically. Hara peko no same.、Um, same is a, is a shark. So, yeah, a hungry shark.、Um, really? Oi boreta kaba. Kaba is a hippo. I don't know what oi boreta is. Let's have a look. Oi boreta. A senile? <laughs> okay. Oi boreta kaba, so a, a, a senile old hippo.、Um, and then sakana no mure. Mure is just a swarm, basically. I think that's, I think that's also a verb. Like mureru is to kind of, you know, to flock together. So mure is just the noun form of that. Sakana no mure. It has to be a sakana no mure, doesn't it? A, a, like a, a school of fish. 
definitely wasn't the others. Uh oh, death question. Whoops. Sorry about that. Um, sabi sabi minato na hako obake. Um, so yeah, rust rust ports. Uh, box monster. Oh god, I I just did this. That's good. Because they half every time, right? Or double, I mean, double in number. Nankai tsubuseba tauretaka. So how many, yeah, how many times... Uh, tsubusu is to, like, to to crush. Um, yeah, to crush or to squash or to, yeah, to destroy, I guess. Nankai tsubuseba tauretaka. So, yeah, how many times, if you destroy them are they defeated or were they defeated kind of thing so how many did you have to destroy to to defeat the boss so of course you start with one so it's going to be an odd number um and then they double so that's three and then they double again so that's seven and then they double again um which is eight more so 15 Nice. Washi na subarashi utagoe de. So my, um, you know, uh, f splendid utagoe is just the word uta meaning song and koe meaning voice. So singing voice. Washi no subarashi utagoe de. So through my wonderful singing voice. Dai ninki no bando wa doreja. Um, dai ninki means, yeah, ninki means um, popularity. And dai is just large. So huge popularity band. Dore. Which of these is the huge popularity band? Or which of these is the name of the of my band which was hugely popular or whatever? <laughs> okay, I think it's that one already. Uh, Gura chan to onabes. So uh, Gura chan, yeah, and the and the the kind of the the cauldrons, I guess. Uh, Gura chan. Wait, wasn't no? Wasn't it this one? The Hawkey Boys. <laughs> I think it's that one. Uh, Gura chan and the Broom Boys, and then Gura chan and Monsters. It's obviously just, you know, Gura chan and Monsters. I think it's the Hokey Boys. Are we on a death square? I'm going to save state here just in case. <laughs> I can't die now. Okay, no, we're not. We're not. Um, I might leave it there. This part's kind of long enough, and I don't want to get into this final cutscene at the end, so. Yeah, so I think I'll I think I'll leave it there and uh, maybe come back. I don't know what I'm gonna do next time. Maybe more quiz. Maybe just finish it. Not sure. But yeah, um, like if you want, sub if you want. Um, need to get up a like patrons page set up. Um, yeah, yeah, I'll do that. Um, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope it's been worth it. Uh, catch you next time.